All right, guys. It's been a rough couple weeks. If anybody was watching the camper series, we haven't gotten to that yet. We ordered a camera on Amazon, and it got delivered, but it never got delivered, so we got a refund. And then all kinds of stuff is happening. The guinea pig's not feeling well. Um, he's been sick. We've been trying to treat him. The goldfish Popeye's acting up. We've been trying to treat the goldfish. So today the school calls and says, oh, uh, the nurse calls and says, oh, last fall we did a thing on your, a test on your daughter's eyes and one of your daughter's eyes wasn't working properly. And now the teacher's complaining that the whiteboard doesn't work. And she never sent me anything about that. Um, never came to my knowledge. So I'm already furious. And I get, my daughter comes home and I asked her about it. And we did a little test. We made our own whiteboard. Or uh, we drew up some letters, small and large, on the fridge. And my girlfriend and I had her look at them. And sure enough, her eye is now... Um, she can't see out of that eye. So yeah, I'm pretty upset. And when she was younger... They had mentioned her eye, and I said, well, they sent, I took her to a specialist, and they diluted her eye and all that, relaxed her eye, and they let her look at things, and they said that she was perfect. So now, a couple of years later, they're telling me about this eye thing that they never even told me about, and they're telling me they told me last fall. Which is complete not true. So, anyway, I made her appointment. And aside from the animals, the guinea pig. And then our dog, our pit bull. Now, she has an ear infection. So that's just another thing on our plate. And the big, biggest thing of all, on top of all this, I've been missing a lot of work for appointments and stuff. And... I don't think I could say anything because the missus doesn't want me to. What? Can I tell him or you want to tell him? Yeah. This is how. Oh, we got big things coming. But the camper is still coming. And the plow trucks. Got tires. Shackle we got the bike. We got. The bike's away, getting tires on it right now. We um, ordered some stuff for Luna's ear at the pit bull. Yeah, we're going to try to treat Luna's ear because we honestly don't have money to bring all the animals to the vet. And honestly, what did people do a hundred years ago? Yeah, they did. People people had any kind of pet you can ever imagine and they treated it the fact that you need to go to a doctor just to treat every little thing yeah, is absurd you research it I research things and I treat it and it's worked out pretty good I haven't lost an animal yeah I mean obviously Paco died but I had him for like 11 years he was a little chihuahua that I rescued but we got him cremated. He is with us. So. Yeah, and that was a lot of money. Uh, but it's always to that point when something's happening to the animal. Like, do you just pay thousands of dollars to try to keep it alive for a year? Or do you let him go? I probably should have just put him down, but I had him so long, I wanted to try to help him. But anyway, we're not talking about him. But anyway, life's been hectic. We are going to fix up that camper. We're going to fix the plow truck. I still got to put a stator in the snowmobile. We got to make my sister's tank a top feed because I'm her landlord. And we got to start. Think, I don't even know. Things are just happening as faster than I can do them. But that's life. So... 
on the next video we'll have some important news to tell you guys so stay tuned thanks for watching everybody who does we appreciate you have a good one